Hey guys, it's Lisa. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. As always, you guys are amazing. If you like my channel, please subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and leave me some comments. Let me know what you guys think. Um, first off, I do want to warn you guys, I'm a little sounding a little wonky because I'm just, I have all this drainage in me. I'm just, just full of just junk and I feel kind of, uh, this is all draining down my throat. My throat is just, it, it hurts. So if I, um, if I sound weird or am just kind of like, it's because I just feel a little crappy today. Um, but I am quite excited because I got a super cool subscription box today. I have received it one other month, last month, and I just had the bomb with this one. This one, I just, I had to get another month of because it was so much fun. And I've been wanting to get one of these subscription boxes for a while. They have a few of them out there. And they are the kind of um, figure it out who done it mystery boxes where they have all these puzzles that you can figure out. And uh, the one I have is the Deadbolt Mystery Society. And I was so impressed with that box. Now, a little bit about me. I love puzzles. I love mysteries. I can figure out mysteries. I can figure out puzzles. I um, It's kind of my bread and butter. Uh, <laughs> sorry to tell this story, but... Uh, my ex-boyfriend, sorry if you're watching this, um, but we went to the movies and we went to watch The Sixth Sense. And about 30 minutes in, if even that, I told him the ending of the movie and he got so mad at me and I felt so bad. But I am just, I, I can figure out movies, I can figure out books, I can figure out puzzles and I just love it. It's just like, it's the way my brain works. Now, things I can't do, <laughs> facial recognition, recon Recognization. I cannot recognize faces. If you're out of your element, like if I work with you and then you're in a different, a whole different element and like a different clothing, I may not recognize you. You could just walk in front of me and I would have no clue who you are. Ex, ex friends, ex employees, just my facial recognition is just awful and it's embarrassing. But, um, also, since the direction, I will have you in a different state trying to give you directions to somewhere. So, never ask me for directions. And if I pass by you and don't recognize you, I apologize. I'm not being, um, yeah, you know what? I'm just not good at it. But um, puzzles, mysteries, anything like that, I am fantastic at. I love these things. Um, I had so much fun. I took a day or an evening and just went through it. And they have all these little puzzles to um, that build up to figuring out a big puzzle. And one thing I like about this one is that it's a standalone. So it's not one that you have to just keep subscribing to. They're all standalone mysteries, which are fantastic and awesome and cool. And you can do this uh, with, like I think it'd be something cool to do with your family or friends. And I'm a little selfish, and I didn't want anybody figuring out my puzzles, so I did it by myself, and I will probably do this one by myself, just because my puzzles, I want to figure them out. But um, I think it'd be something cool like that. Something else that's really cool about the uh, Deadbolt Mystery Society is that you can um, buy standalones. You don't have to do a subscription. You can just buy any old ones. So, like last month, I did Sanitarium, and you could buy that. And I think it's like $24.99 and $4.99 shipping. And that is also how much a subscription is. And so you, if you sign up right now, you will not be getting this, but you can, I'm sure, probably buy this as a single kind of purchase. But um, if you go ahead and sign up, I think the next one they have is called the Body Farm. I don't know anything about it. And uh, I am so sorry if I'm just keeps sniffing but uh yeah i'm just full of junk but uh body farm i don't know anything about it i've just seen the package cover their packages are amazing um oh and something else their customer service is great i uh i emailed them asking them for a code for you guys because i was going to do another uh, month of this and they emailed me back like that with a code so i do have this is $24.99 $4.99 shipping, but I do have a code below, a link and a code where you guys can get 20% off. And um, you put in the code, I think it's like minus 20, you'll see it there, they, they sent me that. And um, 
they give you everything you need to solve the puzzle. You do have to have one of those like little scanner things. Um, because some of those things are kind of interactive. You gotta scan them with your phone, which some people may not have. That could be a drawback, but I think it's super fun. And on the scanner thing, sometimes you have to figure out other puzzles to be able to put in passwords. It's just, I, and there's a little story to it. So it's just, but let's break into this. I will show you what I have. And I did just kind of throw this in here because something I found that was super cool is I did do a review. I was so impressed with them. That I did their, a review of them on Crate Joy. And they sent me, just out of the blue, I didn't even realize I would get it, a few different cards saying, um, thank you so much for taking the time to leave us a review about your experience with us. We appreciate you being part of the Devil Mystery Society. We want to thank you by giving you a special set of three collector's cards for your collection. These have not been included in any boxes that we have released. And they give you a card for each box. And um, the different cards I had was um, Salt Stalk Supernatural Tracker Annihilators and Light Keepers. And that's that one. And then they, that was from last month, and they have The Game. And then they have the Order of the Left Hand. I am left-handed, so I thought this was like really cool. So that was kind of cool that they sent that to me. I didn't expect that. I just, I was really impressed, so I wanted to leave them a cool review. And you guys, yeah, just it, they're amazing. But um, we will delve into this. This is what the box looks like. And they, this was in last month's as well. It just kind of tells you start here. So you've purchased one of our boxes, you've opened it, and you're thinking of yourself, now what? Here are some helpful tips on how to solve the Deadbolt, Deadbolt Mystery Society case. It says compare everything in your box to the contents list for the box you're working. Read everything, look for things in the box that can feasibly connect to each other. Solve all the puzzles. Don't be afraid to use the hint files. I swear, every puzzle I solved, I was like, I'm so smart. This is so great. It, they're, they're, and they're not easy. They're actually kind of complicated. You have to take a little bit of time. Sometimes I'm like, oh gosh, this is just, you're talking down to me. No, these things are not like super easy. They actually are a bit challenging. And it's just like, boom, when you figure it out, it just, it, it feels good. So um, utilize other members of the so society. They do have like a Facebook page and online where you can kind of speak with other members. Um, let's see, they have the QR codes, which you do need to download on your phone or someone's phone. Um, follow your instincts and once you solve the mystery for the month, check your plan. I will say last month I did get it correct. I was super excited about this. And the first thing I have here is a card that says rock and roll. So rock on, and it says start here, and it's one of those little things that you scan. And then you have, um, looks like a backstage pass, VIP Voodoo Mary, and I'll tell you this is some sort of puzzle, or this is a key to a puzzle. Because sometimes things in there, are, <coughs> or at least last month's things in there, they um, certain items were keys to other puzzles. So just give you a heads up on that. Um, there is a guitar pick and this I will tell you is probably a puzzle right here too um, this pick is actually pretty nice oh I will probably get that to Brian after I'm done with it and then I do have my card like I said they send a card each month and this says um, Dolly in the collector's card, first edition. Although she was raised in a Baptist home in southern Louisiana, Mary Kershaw decided to add a little voodoo mystique to her persona in hopes of making a name for herself. As a way of staying in character, Mary is always known to carry this voodoo doll named Dolly around with her. While she doesn't believe in the doll's power, she does consider it, it a good luck charm and refuses to go on stage without it. And there's a few little more to it, but I won't read all that. That's the collector's card, and you, you keep getting different collector's cards. Um, then you have paperwork that kind of just, you have the notes, and you're like an investigator. And um, so usually you want to read this first. It says, notes, at the moment I'm here in an unofficial capacity, but who knows, I solved this case, and I might get to actually meet Voodoo Mary herself. Here's what I've observed so far. And then it just goes through... Um, 
just the different observations and there's puzzles on the back so that's cool um, and then I have this which is the LOA um, guitars keyboards drums bass uh, and guitars and so this is a puzzle as well carbon underground that's another puzzle and each of these puzzles go together so you can figure out who the murder is because I think there's always a murder. Last month there was a murder. There's a murder in this month. So, and it's the who done it. Then you have a package here, which has all your suspects. And I'll just kind of go through these. So you have your different pictures of your different suspects. And on the back, they tell you what they play. It tells you about them. See, it's full, it's full on. I think this is like put out by an escape room company, but I swear it's just it's a great story it's fun to do you kind of immerse yourself you're not watching TV you're not sitting there on your computer looking at like Facebook or Twitter or YouTube or something like that it's just something different to do and I had so much fun um, Voodoo Mary pins and needles tour 2019 I'll tell you this much this is probably a key but it may be the puzzle we'll see I, I have no clue what's what. There's a lot of stuff in this one. Um, the Carbon Underground. Here's a list of what we're listening to listening to now in preparation for the upcoming Voodoo Mary show. And there's a playlist. And it has this, which we saw earlier. So these probably go together. And you probably use one to figure out the other one. Um, here's another one of those QR codes. Uh, let's see, here is something else that looks like it is some sort of puzzle or key. Um, print taken from rental car used to transport Mary to interviews. So there's that. Then there's another either key or puzzle. Let's see, and it looks like this is a key card welcome enjoy your stay and on the back you've got one of those little qr codes and you may not be able to get in that it's a lot of those are password protected and you have to figure out the password um, there's a postcard with another one there's a lot to this one it just keeps going uh, looks like a probably witness interview um, there's some fingerprints I'm excited to delve into this. This just, this looks really, really cool. Um, something else. Reg Kennedy Promotions. So, something else. This is either a clue or a uh, puzzle. A dressing room with another QR code. Let's see. Jigsaw Heart. It looks like it is a song. That probably is a clue. And then they always send you something that says ready to solve the box. Once you um, once you are ready to solve the box, you scan the QR and you put in who you think did it. Uh, this says use first name of killer plus name of Mary's last song. So you usually have to figure out two different things. I think the last time the people played like a game and you had to figure out their character and who the person, real person was. So it's like a double kind of figure it out. And then there looks like maybe a witness interview and a puzzle on the back of that. And everything, everything has something to it. And here's the set list. So there's something probably in that as well. And it looks like that's everything in the box. I am super excited to try this out. Um, there is a lot to this one. You guys, if you are interested, I have a link down below where you can get 20% off. And I had a lot of fun. It's normally, I think, all together with shipping, like $29.99, but 20% off. And you guys, this is, and you can buy, you don't have to subscribe. You can just buy single ones if you have a party coming up and you want to do something different. But this I found super fun. Their customer service is great and I enjoyed it. So you guys, check down below if you're interested. If you like my channel, please subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and leave me some comments. Let me know what you guys think. And you guys, as always, rock on.